And tell me, tell me one more time, um, you know, the, again, the pothole cameras take what we know about the pothole, you know, the potholes and the damage that we can all feel in the car and cause immediate damage. And then the two laser cameras, again, on the bottom that, that do the roughness of the road. Yeah, the, the roughness and the curvature and, and the drop-off of the road. So that pretty much tells you the uh, texture and feel of the road, if the road has a deep slope to it or, or not. That, that's the data that you get off of this. And actually gives you the rutting. So I'm not, if you're familiar with, like, let's say if you're at a, a very busy intersection that has a lot of stops at it and you see those divots in the wheel paths, mm -hmm. those are very dangerous. So you don't want those, of course, on your interstate roads. So these lasers capture the rutting measurements in the, in the wheel paths of the roads as well to let the DOT know if there's high rutting in this place, then that road needs to be paved because it's a, it's a safety concern. And as, we, as I said to you before, uh, obviously we know what happens when you hit a pothole and the, the damage it causes. What do people experience on a rough ride? Well, on, on a rough ride, it's very bumpy. Your, your stand wheel might shake and it, it adds a little extra wear and tear on your road, on your vehicle. Uh, that's what you experience on a, on a rough road. Let's head on just quickly back over here and, and tell me again about, so we've got, this is called uh, Automatic Road uh, Analyzer, uh, ARAN. ARAN. Yeah. ARAN, okay. And if you can just step on, on this side of me over here, we'll take a look at this, uh, this item over here. Tell me yeah, about so that right again. You're looking at the uh, DMI, the Digital Measuring Instrument. Um, this is how we accurately measure how the distance that we're going. So it makes sure that one mile is actually one mile when we're driving. <laughs> um, so, so, and that calibrates to make sure that the, the pictures are accurately synced up. Yes, uh, and this is calibrated and periodically. Um, we do monthly calibrations and weekly, but we also do daily checks. So in the morning when the crew fires up to get ready to take off, they check all of the systems and they check the DMI to make sure that that's reading accurately. And if it's not, then it'll be calibrated that morning. So that, okay. Let's uh, head back towards the front here. So the other thing you were showing me, which is certainly uh, interesting, is this that is the this uh, camera right of way top. camera. Okay, so what does that do? That captures, uh, well, it's used for several different things. It's used to give the DOT a video inventory of their network. It's also used to extract assets. Our, our software is very sophisticated where we can actually pull the GPS location of signs and everything that's on the side of the road, signs and guardrails and that, things of that nature on the side of the road. And from that image, give you the exact GPS point of where that sign is in, in, on the road. Tell, so, tell me again how many, uh, you were saying something interesting before about how many pictures all these cameras take and how much data do you guys go through? Yeah, we, we go through uh, terabytes of data. Like I said, a, a client like VDOT will go through easily, you know, 15 to 18 terabytes in one collection season. So we, in-house, we were able to store, we have a petabyte server that's able to store thousands of terabytes of data. And that's interesting because of the fact that on the market, a typical person who wants to have an external hard drive could maybe get a two, three terabyte hard drive. Yes. But the fact that they, that you guys, you guys need, you know, thousands of terabytes for all the work you do across the country. Yeah, that, I mean, it's, it's, a, it's a very heavy data intensive. The images are very data in, intensive. The, uh, the pavement image are more so than the right of way image. They can be compressed down a little further than the uh, pavement images are, but it's a lot of data that's getting processed. Uh, and that's why we save the DOT so much money, because we can host this data on our servers. 